Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphenate here, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to game capture your PS3. Now, unfortunately, the PS3 has a security block built in that enables HDCP at all times. So if you try to connect your PS3 via HDMI to a game capture device, it's not gonna allow you to have any feed. You're gonna get a completely black screen. So if you're trying to use your Elgato Cam Link or your Elgato capture card like the HD60S Plus, and you're trying to run that into a game capture software like OBS, you won't get a feed at all. But today I'm gonna show you guys how to do that very easily. All you need is an adapter. It's an HDMI splitter that's gonna take the HDMI output from your PS3 into the splitter, and the splitter is gonna bypass HDCP. There are two HDMI outputs on the splitter. If your capture card has an HDMI throughput like the Elgato HD60, then you don't need to use the second output on the splitter and you can use the HDMI out from the capture card to go into your TV. If your game capture card doesn't have an HDMI throughput like the Elgato Cam Link 4K, then you'll definitely wanna use the second HDMI out from the splitter to go to your TV. It's really that simple. Once everything's connected properly, you should get your feed through your capture card. So here I have OBS open. I'm using the Elgato Cam Link to capture my device. Now normally I actually use an HD60S Plus, but for this video, I'm just using the Cam Link. But you can see here, I have my PS3 set up and if I move everything around, you see everything, everything works as it normally would. And you can look here at the audio mixer and you'll see the sound is actually coming through as well. Now, when I first got it all hooked up and the feed came in through my capture card, I did have an audio issue. It had a nonstop, extremely loud static sound that did not stop whatsoever. I'm gonna show you guys the quick and easy steps to fix that if you have that same problem. We're gonna go into the PS3 settings and then we're gonna go down to sound settings. Click on that. We're gonna go to the audio multi output. Make sure that that is off. Audio output settings, click on that. And then we're gonna select HDMI, click right. And then here we're gonna go to manual, not automatic output format. We're gonna go to manual. Click right on that. Now here you can see a whole bunch of different options. Currently, I have linear PCM two channel 96 kilohertz. This is the new setting that I selected to fix the audio sound. Originally, when I first connected the PS3, it had Dolby Digital 5.1 channel. Having that selected was actually causing the issue. Once I switched it to linear PCM two channel 96 kilohertz, that static sound completely went away and everything worked perfectly. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you select this and click right. Then there is a warning, if the device in use does not support the frequency selected, the speakers may become damaged. Personally, it had no issues for me going into a 4K TV and into my capture card. Press OK, and then press Enter. So there you guys have it. That's how simple it is to game capture your PS3. Again, you will need this HDMI splitter, and I do have a link for this splitter in the description where you can purchase it from Amazon. It doesn't change the price that you get it at, but it does help this channel. Please make sure to drop a like on this video. Drop a comment below if you have any questions and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.